Greetings ladies and gentlemen. Today I stand here to explain the importance of good writing to the engagement of readers. To help me prove my point, I will be using Robert Graves' poem, A Child's Nightmare, as an example. Before I continue my speech, when was the last time you read a poem? Was it yesterday, last week, last month? If you can remember the poem word for word, think about how the writer was able to engage you into reading more of the poem. This will help you understand why good writing is important. Good writing is very important to the readers because it makes the text interesting and engaging. If the poem is not interesting, no one would want to read it and it would make the poet go bankrupt. I'm joking. What is good writing, you ask? Good writing is, a way, is the way a poet writes his text to the readers. For example, Poets use conventions and poetic techniques to enhance the poem and intensify the mood or feeling. This will make the readers have emotion while reading, making them engaged. The poet Robert Graves deliberately uses horn conventions and poetic techniques in Child's Nightmare to engage his readers. The first way Robert Graves displayed good writing is through the making of his characters. Robert Graves has done this by making them interesting and full of life almost as if they are real. One of the characters in the poem is the cat. The protagonist describes the cat as his nightmare. In one paragraph, the protagonist saw the cat and described that his black bolt darkening the day. From this, we know that the cat is black. The technique used is symbolism. Robert Graves wants the readers to think that the cat is connected to evil and bad luck. This makes the readers keep their attention focused on the cat and its intentions. The poets, hmm. in the poem, this makes the cat looks and sound treacherous. This makes the readers afraid of the cat. Another way Robert Graves displayed good writing is by using poetic devices in the plot. He did this so his readers would be more attracted to the story. The plot, on the, the, the plot of the poem focuses on the protagonist's nightmare, a black cat. In most paragraphs, Robert Graves mentions the sentence, as he let my blood, in a voice cruel and flat, say forever, cat, cat, cat. In this sentence, repetition is present. Robert Graves repeated the words cat over and over again in the story because he didn't want the readers to lose their understanding of the nightmare. It is important that readers don't forget the main idea of the text they are reading. If they do, they will lose their focus and interest in the text Another way Robert Graves displayed good writing is in his choice of words. Robert Graves chose specific words to make the story sound better, based on the, the, the theme and mood. This is called the choice of words. It is really important for the author to think what, about what words they will include because of the way they sound and their connotation. Out of the two reasons, I will only focus on connotations because I believe they are more important. In A Child's Nightmare, some words that the author include are despair, faded, and overpowered. Hearing these words make you feel hopeless and scared, don't they? This is because words carry cultural and emotional meanings, in addition to their literal meanings. In the poem, there was a scene where the protagonist was overpowered by the cat, overpowered me foot and head. This makes the readers worry about the protagonist and at the same time feel scared about the cat. In conclusion, it is clear that good writing is important to engage the readers. It is also clear that Robert Graves displayed good writing in his poem, A Child's Nightmare. This is because Robert Graves thinks about his readers and how he can satisfy them. Thank you. Okay, mm. okay now. Uh, how do you stop this?